Now, the WGAL News 8 Storm Team Forecast with meteorologist Ethan Houston. The Mid-South is under the gun for severe weather today. Places like Little Rock, Arkansas and Memphis, Tennessee. For us here in the Susquehanna Valley, look for passing showers and scattered thunderstorms as we head through the afternoon. An isolated storm could be strong with some gusty winds. You can see we've got the moisture moving on in in the form of a thick veil of high and mid-level clouds, but it is warm out there right now. 72 degrees in the capital city starting to feel a little sticky with dew points sitting in the lower 50s. We're already up to 76 in Lancaster and it's 75 in Gettysburg. Zooming in on the radar, you can see we've got some showers moving in through parts of Franklin County, now moving into western Adams County, up into Perry and Juniata counties. This line will move through early this afternoon, but another line of showers will likely move as we get closer towards dinner time. It's that line we could see perhaps a few thunderstorms in the mix that could produce some gusty winds. But look at the temperatures climbing into the lower or 80s in a few spots. I think highs in most of our cities will be close to 80 degrees. For tonight, look for a few passing showers early. Then we get some breaks in the clouds. Temperatures will fall to just near 60 degrees. And then for your Thursday, much of the same type of weather. Although I expect a few more passing showers and thunderstorms as we head through the early afternoon with highs once again up near 80 degrees. Overall threat for severe weather is low, but just not ruling out an isolated strong to severe storm with some damaging winds. This will also be the case tomorrow, but overall threat both both days are very low. Here's a breakdown of the rain chances for today. Highest near sunset and then quickly tapering off as we head past 10 to 11. So right now 71 in Lebanon, the same in Elizabethtown, 76 in Ephrata into the 80s already towards uh, the outer banks. But look at that sharp cool down, that clash of warm and cold air. That's where we find the threat for severe weather. There already are tornado watches in effect for parts of Arkansas up into Missouri. But for us here in the valley, spotty shower and thunderstorm possible. There you can see right around five o'clock, some passing showers and thunder showers. And then as we head through the early overnight hours, the chance of a passing shower will continue. It's after midnight. I think we get a little bit of a lull. And then as we head through tomorrow, we'll start the day off with some sunshine. And then around lunchtime, that first band of showers comes on through. But then we could see a secondary line of showers and thunder showers move right along that cold front during the evening drive time before skies begin to clear on out and temperatures actually start to drop as we head into Friday. We will continue to see temperatures dropping as we head on into the weekend. So warm temperatures up near 80 degrees the next two days. And then as we head into the Easter holidays, some passing showers for your Saturday, breezy, cooler, but dry for Easter Sunday.